We kick off Monday with major details into the shooting of a DPS trooper. Good evening. Thank you for joining us. I'm Brenda Medina. The suspect is facing three counts of attempted capital murder. The trooper fighting for his life at this hour. And the district attorney's office is building a case. Local 23's Derek Garcia has been following the breaking news all weekend. Derek, big details being released. Uh, good evening, Brenda. Big details from a short and to the point press conference with Edinburgh Police Chief Cesar Torres. There are no other suspects in connection to this shooting that are wanted at this time. DPS Trooper Moises Sanchez is recovering. Meanwhile, the suspect, 24 year old Victor Alejandro Godinez of Edinburgh, is charged with three counts of attempted capital murder. Now, this is a large scale investigation because it involves three cities and two agencies. And the Texas Rangers are investigating all of the shootings that took place. So we we are praying for him and the family. As of Monday, DPS Trooper Moises Sanchez remains hospitalized after being shot Saturday night, allegedly by this man, 24-year-old Victor Alejandro Godinez. The shooting happened while Sanchez was responding to a crash in McAllen on 10th Street and Freddy Gonzalez. Subject wearing a black hoodie, black hoodie seen running. What followed was a manhunt spreading across the UTRGV campus, while first responders like Gilbert Leal of Hidalgo EMS worked to save the trooper's life. We're one team. Um, there's no 912, there's only 911, so it's up to us. Make sure we keep those areas hot again. After hours on the run, Edinburgh police tracked down Godinez and exchanged gunfire. Cell phone video captured the arrest made on Luna Street and Monmac Road. All officers were not injured. Uh, the individual suspect uh, had an injury believed to be a gunshot. Uh, it is unsure at this time if it came directly from the initial shooting from the state trooper or the second shooting with Edinburgh Police Department. Edinburgh Police did recover Godinez's alleged firearm, a 357 revolver. And also confirming body cam and dash cam recorders were rolling. Tonight, he's in a Hidalgo County jail on a $1 million bond and three charges of attempted capital murder. Meanwhile, Trooper Sanchez is in stable but critical condition. And tomorrow, a prayer vigil will be held here at 6.30 p.m. Those who have shared their prayers and wishes to Trooper Sanchez can do it along with those who serve with him with the Texas Department of Public Safety. Brenda. All right, Derek, thank you.